My name is Katina Knotten, and we are at Single Thread Farm out in the Dry Creek Valley in Healdsburg, California, Sonoma County. The purpose of this farm is many, um, but the purpose of this farm is really to, um, to be here rooted in the community, to be bringing a lot of biodiversity to this grape growing region, and um, to supply our amazing culinary team. We take our farming practices very seriously and everything is hand scaled. Uh, we really redefined and, uh, and redesigned what farming is to us and what, this, what the layout of our farm is. So we, what that means to us is that we broke all of our growing blocks down to 50 by 50 or 50 by 100 foot blocks. And, um, and we work everything by hand. So we really take the time to grow everything slowly and gently and always growing with nature and not against it. Actually, we're, we're taking steps back to be able to move forward. We're hearkening back to our ancestors and the ways that they lived um, symbiotically with the land. We're never taking more than the land is willing to give. In fact, we're always giving more than we're taking. We're putting a lot of energy into the soil and, um, and really focusing our energy on growing healthy soil in order to grow healthy crops. We decide what we want to grow really based on conversations we have with our chefs, with our culinary team, and just naturally as farmers, after doing this for so many years, we're always curious about new varieties and always trying to stoke the fires of creativity with our culinary team by bringing them in new varieties, new flavors, textures, color profiles. But it really starts with the conversation with the culinary team, what inspires them, maybe what we've learned from uh, seasons past, what they really loved, maybe what they they didn't gravitate towards as much, and, um, and then we kind of go from there. What makes this farm special is that we are bringing so much biodiversity to this grape growing region. And I think that is our, our number one priority. We are on 24 acres here and we are surrounded by vineyards. Um, we're not just bringing biodiversity to the property as a whole. We're also bringing a lot of biodiversity into our growing blocks, which is extremely important to us. Beyond that, what makes this farm really special is that we're really rooted in education. Education is so important to us. Being able to invite our, our chefs, our community, our guests onto the property and connect them to our food systems to teach them about our farming practices is, is such a responsibility that we don't take lightly. It's something that we want to share. We want to be able to allow people to come here and to connect and, uh, and learn this expression of agriculture. Uh, my advice to chefs um, is to be able to connect with their food systems is to you know really maybe go to farmers markets, learn who your local farmers are. I think we we make a big impact when we vote with our dollars. So really take the time to understand in your community who is doing that work, who's putting that time in, understand where your food is coming from. I think a lot about the importance of kind of changing the conversation around farming because far too often or far too long now, the conversation around farming has been about what we can take from the land. And it's been this take, take, take mentality for so long now. And I think the sooner we can change the conversation around that, then the more we can start viewing farming as, um, as opposed to working the land, it's more of a how can we work with the land mentality. And I think that'll just serve us so well.